Well, hello and good morning there, um, people in the vlogosphere. I uh, just wanted to uh, give an update on our adoption process. Um, not really too much to, uh, to report today. Just kind of wanted to keep everybody abreast of what was going on. The date is September 17th. Uh, 2019. Um, Sonia and I just last night uh, finished up the um, paperwork for our um, home study. Uh, gotta say it's not my favorite part of the whole adoption process, the paperwork. Um, there were a lot of uh, different forms that we had to fill out, uh, guardianship forms, um, some legal documents and disclaimers and we just had to sign and acknowledge those but um, probably the uh, the biggest ones were our financial um, statements our financial snapshot I guess of our liabilities and uh, assets that kind of thing um, and then filling out of the uh, background check so we have to order a background check through Child Protective Services and one through um, Indiana State Police. Um, those are <laughs> pretty pretty long forms and uh, we kind of hit a humorous spot last night during the uh, filling out of this paperwork where um, Sonia would get about halfway done and she'd mess something up and we didn't have any white out so she would basically have to just start over and so I think she started over maybe three or four times because <laughs> she would fill something out wrong or or whatever but it was it was kind of humorous to watch her go through that but um but that was really the only humorous part of the whole process <laughs> to be honest with you there's a lot of um a lot of pen to paper and I just in several times caught myself thinking and even saying out loud what century is this that we are filling out forms with pens and um, you know is there there's got to be some easier way to uh, enter this information once and have it go to some kind of database where you could pull it up and and transfer the information between documents and stuff like that but no you gotta each form you got to fill out the same information as you did on the on the previous form and anyway it's it's a uh it's a tedious process to say the least but uh anyway we are planning a fundraiser um coming up here next month um at our house it's going to be a kind of a bake and craft sale and we've got a, a number of people who are donating their um, donating their talents and their uh, the baked goods and crafts and such and and uh, we are very very thankful for that so the the money raised towards um, the money raised at this event will go towards our paying for our home study and our uh, travel expenses um, so and ho hopefully everything will hopefully everything else will be taken care of by uh, uh, through sacred selections so uh, so far, so good on that. So really, um, you know, that's really the only thing that we have to report. Um, just kind of filling out paperwork and waiting and um, wondering how Maglina's doing and hope she, hopefully she's doing okay. We, uh, or Sonia wrote her a letter not too long ago and it's, uh, you know, it's, it's very slow. It's got to be run through the channels and translated and she reads it and responds and goes back through the same channels and and such. So um, anyway, it's a very slow way of communicating with her, but hopefully that can change once we meet her on the first visit and um, are able to, from what we understand, connect with her um, and chat with her um, through the orphanage there. So uh, that's really about all that's going on. I can't really think of anything else that is, uh, is going on at this time, but it's a slow process and we're anxious to get her, uh, get her into our family. Um, so when I have something else to report, I'm sure I'll update everybody. Have a great day.